Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 275 55ths R20 to 285 55ths R20. The diameter difference between these tire sizes is 1.4%, which is within the acceptable 3% range. This makes the interchange a viable option without necessitating major adaptations. Switching to 285 55ths increases the diameter by 0.43 inches. This will slightly raise the vehicle's ground clearance, enhancing its capability for off-road driving and navigating rough terrains. This minor increase will not significantly impact the speedometer reading. The 285 55ths tire is wider by 0.39 inches compared to the 275 55ths. This increased width offers a larger contact patch, improving traction and stability, especially in off-road conditions. However, it may also lead to slightly higher rolling resistance, potentially affecting fuel efficiency. The sidewall height of the 285 55ths is increased by 0.22 inches. A larger sidewall height enhances impact absorption, providing a more comfortable ride, particularly on rough terrains. It also adds to the overall durability of the tire, making it more resistant to damage. With the larger 285 55ths tires, the speedometer will read slightly lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 miles per hour, the actual speed will be approximately 20.27 miles per hour. Based on our observation, switching to 285 55ths R20 offers benefits such as improved ground clearance, better traction, and enhanced ride comfort due to the increased sidewall height. However, these changes might slightly affect fuel efficiency and speedometer accuracy. Overall, the interchange is a practical choice for those looking to enhance their vehicle's off-road performance and stability.